Hi Scorpio, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for all your likes, shares, and subscribes. For a personal reading, please visit my website or send me an email. All the information is in the description box below. All right, Scorpio, so I'm picking up that there is something that you want to reveal to somebody or there is something that you want to open somebody, like it's almost like open your eyes. It's almost like you're like, open your eyes. You can't see, like open your eyes. I just keep hearing open your eyes. It's almost like it's something like right in front of you that you're kind of missing, maybe. Okay, what messages do you have for Scorpio? Rejection. Okay, Scorpio. I feel like with this card, um, Scorpio, you're feeling kind of left out, but I feel like things are going to change for you. I feel like whatever is making you feel left out, you're going to... Um, change that and I feel like you're thinking about someone because I see someone in the in the picture in the background here you can see um but I feel like it's like memories you're thinking about uh someone you're also feeling lonely and I feel like for some of you again that could be why I kept hearing open your eyes it's like you want this person to see you for who you are you want this person to see you there is something that um you feel like is missing okay yeah, with the two of pentacles, I feel like you feel like you're trying to balance, like a balancing act. You're feeling like um, you're, you don't want to have to go to this person. You feel like this person should come to you. I feel like you don't want to be a chaser. You don't feel that you need to chase someone. You feel that this person needs to come to you. Something Again, I keep hearing it open your eyes. Spirit, what messages do you have for Scorpio, please? Here are the messages you have for Scorpio. We have the Nine of Cups. Yeah, I feel like um, Scorpio, you feel that you know that you could be happy with this person or you know that this person loves you and you love them. But I feel like you don't understand why the rejection, why this person is not coming forward, why they're not coming towards you, why they're not opening up. Okay. What messages do you have for Scorpio? What messages do you have for Scorpio? Yeah, temperance. I feel like you're trying to balance everything out. Also, um, for some of you, I feel like you're trying to um, pull you and this person together um, in a union. Um, I feel like for some of you, you may be trying to. Um, you could be. Um, um, dabbing in some type of uh also magic i feel because i feel like there is something that you're trying like you're trying to come up with some type of concoction or something to um maybe pull someone towards you for some of you yeah we have the six of pentacles and the ten of pentacles i feel like you know that if this could be more but um almost like i feel like someone is kind of pulling back like they're coming forward um and you again you know scorpio i just you know that, that scorpio i just feel like there is something that um or i'm sorry um i just feel like there is something that you know scorpio that you know that you and this person can work things out okay i feel like you and this person something is like it just keeps telling me that you know and your heart that you and this person should be together, okay? With the Six of Cups and the Ace of Swords, there's um, also like some type of truth or some type of something that's coming in. Um, I feel like for some of you, um, you are going to have a conversation or they're going to have a conversation with you, okay? And I feel like there is going, and it's kind of, I feel like for some of you, it may be very emotional, okay? Because again, I feel like certain things are kind of at a standstill between you and this person. Okay. Um, for some of you, you already had this discussion. Okay. The Empress. Um, for some of you, I feel like um, you could be, you know. Scorpio, I feel like a lot of you know your strength, know who you are, know that you are the Empress. Okay, um, for some of you Scorpios, I feel like you're you're um, 
you have maybe children with this person. Um, this person, I feel, uh, for some of you Scorpios, again, I feel like you know your power. You know who you are. Okay? You understand. Um, for some of you, I'm also picking up um, that you're changing. It's almost like you're coming from the ashes and you're going back up. I feel like in the past, you felt kind of low and down. But I feel like something is rising within you. And it's like... Um, you know, egging you to move forward, pushing you forward, open you up, okay? Yeah, um, with the moon the, and the eight of wands, again, I'm feeling like there's a lot of communication. Maybe um, you're getting like messages um, through spirit coming, to, coming towards you. It could be also in your dream state, okay? But I feel like you're like something is pulling something is um, also um, for some of you, it could be like downloads. Some type of information is coming towards you to help you with some type of clarity as well. OK, Scorpio, um, with the King of Pentacles, I feel like there may be someone else coming um, coming in. And this um, could be like a Virgo Capricorn or Taurus or someone that's more like um, very job oriented. Um, a little bit balanced in your life. They're trying to balance out their life as well. But the two of swords and the justice. I feel like you're trying to balance out your karma. You're trying to balance out certain things that need to work for you. Okay. I feel like certain you're making a decision to move forward with something. Okay. I'm also picking up that for some of you, you're like, um, you're paying off some type of debt. And that could be your karmatic debt. Um, I feel like you're trying, you're starting to come into some type of awareness that's going to show you something, okay? With the nine of swords and the three of wands, okay? I feel like you're, you already, um, you're fighting your, but I feel like some of it, this is mental, like something about your mental, like a mental, um, battle within yourself okay because again like i was saying before you you know sometimes you felt kind of low and i feel like you're coming out of the ashes you're changing some type of transformation okay and i feel like you're grabbing the reins you're grabbing some type of reins and you're just going to be moving forward okay yeah with the ace of cups you're gonna, like something is coming towards you some type of offer all right, because you're making this decision to come out of this depression, out of these things. I'm, I'm also picking up for some of you, you've been really cruel to yourself. You've been mean to yourself, not just to others, but to yourself. And I feel like that is changing. Okay. Yeah, what other messages and reference to? Okay. Oh, here we go. So, you know, um, oh my God, I don't know why, but I'm picking up Aquarius. So you may be dealing with an Aquarius or um, another uh, with an air sign. Okay, so uh, Scorpio, I'm also picking up like um, we have control, mirroring, and healing. And for some of you, I feel like you and this person are marrying each other. I feel like they have, there may have been some type of words or something that was said between you and this person um, that kind of hurt this person or maybe hurt you as well. Okay. And that could be due to someone wants to control the relationship, but I feel like both of you want to control the relationship. Okay. Instead of allowing it to just take its natural course or let people be who they are. Okay. Um, and I feel like, so both of you are mirroring each other, but I feel like you both have to heal from something or something um, is coming towards you to help you heal. And I get, and I feel like this may be the truth or some truth that you need to speak or this person needs to speak to you. Okay. So thank you so much, Scorpio. Please like and subscribe and I'll speak to you soon. Bye-bye.